This is a guide on replacing a screen on an Asus M509. To begin, turn off the laptop and disconnect the power cord. The bezel is held in place with Phillips screws in the bottom corners. The screws are covered with tiny pieces of plastic. Use an X-Acto knife to remove the plastic covers in the bottom corners. Using a Phillips screwdriver, remove the two screws. Insert a plastic pick between the bezel and the LCD. Move it along the perimeter. Separate the bezel. The bezel on this laptop has a broken uh, hinge cover, so it remains in place, and the other hinge cover comes off with a bezel. Put the bezel aside. The screen is glued to two vertical rails. Remove two Phillips screws in the top corners to loosen the mounting rails. Use a plastic pick to separate the screen from the rails and place the screen on the keyboard. Peel off the clear tape securing the video connector and using both hands, disconnect the video cable. Discard the old screen. Place the new screen on the keyboard and using both hands, gently reconnect the video cable. Secure it with clear tape. Caution, it is very important not to force any connectors. Also, make sure not to twist or slant the connector when plugging it in. Lift the screen up and lean it against the back cover. Test the new screen. The screen is working and we can finish the installation process. The glue remaining on the rails is still sufficient to hold the screen. In case you need new adhesive, you can always buy adhesive strips on our site, LaptopScreen.com. Clean the sides of the new screen with cloth and rubbing alcohol. Lift the screen up and glue it to the rails, applying some pressure. Fit the screen back into the back cover. Replace two Phillips screws on the top corners. Remove the protective film from the new LCD. Replace the bezel. Start from the bottom, then go around the perimeter, snapping tabs back in place. Turn the laptop sideways and make sure that the bezel is snapped in in the bottom of the display assembly. Replace two Phillips screws in the bottom corners. Replace the two plastic covers. Turn the laptop on, and we're done.